What's up guys? We're in Kentucky walking the dogs right now. It's not really morning anymore. It's kind of woke up late from, we drove so much the last two days that we needed to take one day to sleep in um, and kind of like re-energize. And right now it's like noon and it's 86 degrees. So it's not too bad. I mean, we're coming from Miami, so it's not that bad. Um, and we're usually used to the humidity. And this is a lot drier. Uh, it's still a little humid, but it's not, it's not like crazy humid like Miami is. So it, it actually feels good. It feels really cool to us. <clears throat> good boy. Come on. Now we're just walking them. We are not walking them. I, I don't know if you saw when we got here uh, yesterday, we let them go. We just let them loose off leash, just walking everywhere, wherever they wanted. Uh, I didn't realize how crazy, I had read about it, about the ticks that, you know, they'll, they'll get on you if you're walking through the trails and stuff, but I didn't realize how intense and crazy it would be. Uh, when they came in, they were both, not full, but they had both had like two ticks a piece that we saw, and they were really hairy dogs and we don't want them getting ticks. They do get their, their tick and flea medication, so that we, we like actually looked up to make sure uh, the tick that they had, we took a picture of it, and we looked up to see if the medication that we give them would be fine, and they're good, but still, you know, ticks carry diseases and stuff, so if you're ever coming on one of these kind of trips or going on a hiking trail, uh, just make sure to, to keep your dog on flea and tick medications. Just keep them up to date with all their vaccines and stuff. All right, let's show you some of what Apollo's looking for. So there's a dead end and on the other side of the fork there was a house so we're going back up this little hill kind of back towards our house that we're still at. Venus! What happened Venus? What happened? Did you put it in the road? No, that's where the, they, they blocked the road. Yeah. But they said it was closed? Yeah. Yes. We found them. Look. We found them. Now we are in the sky bridge. Sky lift. The sky lift. Sky, sky lift to the natural bridge. Unfortunately, the dogs cannot come here because it's a lift like the ones that you will get uh, for a ski resort. But I'm gonna bring you along anyway, even though the dogs are not with us. So join us. This looks so cool. It goes down and then it goes up. I don't know if you guys could see really good how the lift goes here, but I have never seen it like that. It goes down first 
and it's pretty pretty high over there I don't even want to think about it coming down back <laughs> I don't think they're going up is gonna be that bad, but I think they're going down back is gonna be a little scary. That's where we came from and it's scary and then we will go down this way they look more normal our friends are down there already but I'm a scary cat so I'm still up here <laughs> you saw that cave over there what the cave yeah it's cool right Now we are on top of the bridge. Is this is the largest of the arches? But I don't know how to get down there. I wanna get down to see the arch from the bottom. Let's see if even one of these signs it says how we get down there. Look at that. That's awesome. And now we are going down. It looks very, very steep from here. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha 